All right, Laura is now a uh, tropical depression, losing its tropical characteristics, but it's still a pretty potent storm. It's centered over western Kentucky, and it's still producing some heavy rain and even a, a tornado's threat. So you can see the circulation right over western Kentucky. It is moving to the uh, east-northeast, and some of that tropical moisture will come into play here in Connecticut as we go into the uh, day tomorrow. But today, a beautiful day, a nice break from yesterday's severe weather. Look at the tranquil scene on this pond in Norfolk. Thanks to uh, Jim me in for this picture because it's calm you can see the reflection of the trees on the water and what a beautiful sky we have right now over stores and we're looking up partly sunny with some high clouds and old Saybrook we will see an increase in cloud cover as we go through tonight but right now it's dry so if you have outdoor plans for a Friday evening or you might want to go out and enjoy yourself you don't have any bad weather to worry about whatsoever so it's 83 in Hartford it's 78 degrees in Groton and it's in the upper 70s in uh, northwestern Connecticut at the moment and dew points range anywhere from 57 in Windsor Locks and Hartford to 67 degrees in New Haven so we're kind of on the uh, cuff so to speak of uh, some very humid air you can see off to our south dew points are in the uh, 70s and that boundary is just to the south of Connecticut and that's where we find the severe weather right now moving uh, through Philadelphia on into New Jersey but this front will come back at us later tonight as a warm front and with that will come clouds and some showers so uh, futurecast shows that we'll have increasing clouds uh, showers will arrive especially after midnight tomorrow morning it could be underdone there will be showers and maybe even a thunderstorm in the uh, state and then we'll be dealing with showers and thunderstorms off and on during the day tomorrow and there's the remnants of uh, laura now we're not exactly sure where the heaviest rain will fall but at seven o'clock tomorrow evening futurecast is saying southeastern Connecticut. It could be further to the west. We're just not exactly sure. But tropical downpours uh, could cause some localized uh, flash flooding. But as a cold front moves through tomorrow night, it's going to clear all that tropical moisture away. So Sunday is looking like a beautiful day with partly to mostly sunny skies. A northwesterly breeze will usher in much drier air as well. So lows tonight will be in the 60s, 65 to 70 range, maybe even low 70s in places like Bridgeport. And your highs for tomorrow will range uh, from the upper 70s to maybe the lower 80s. What you really will notice tomorrow is the humidity. It's going to feel tropical outside. All right, here's your seven day forecast Sunday. That is the pick of the weekend, partly sunny and breezy 79 uh, down to 52 Sunday night and Monday. Oh, that's going to be a, a nine or 10 day right there. Sunny and 79. There could be some showers around Tuesday morning and then partly sunny and 78. And right now we're keeping Wednesday dry. There are some questions as to where showers, how close they'll come. But for now, we're, we'll keep uh, Wednesday dry and a high of 82. Thursday could be hot. Highs near 90 and turning more humid. A chance for a late day thunderstorm, a shower or storm possible on Friday as well. For the shoreline this weekend, 80 both Saturday and Sunday.